Today we're talking on how you can create network reports in a NetBiz. Before showing you a demo on the dashboard to create reports, let me uh, touch base quickly about what type of network reports you can get out of NetBiz. So the current version has a four type of reports, one generic network status, one about agent performance, one about target performance, and the last type of reports is around scheduled tests. Uh, agent performance uh, typically represent the uh, performance of the network location where the agent is located versus uh, target performance is uh, uh, reports the performance of the applications or service that you're monitoring with uh, different agents. Uh, scheduled test is pretty self-explanatory um, as you be able to get a report on a throughput run by iPerf or upload and download speed uh, via network speed test and on VoIP you can get a uh, mean opinion score and other uh, nice parameters to understand the uh, performance of your network for VoIP calls. These reports then as you will see they can be um, displayed in the dashboard or they can uh, be uh, sent via email um, as an attachment uh, in PDF. So enough said, let's jump to the NetBiz dashboard to show you what this is about. Um, I'm gonna add uh, my screen in full screen and you can see that I'm in the report tab of the NetBiz dashboard. Uh, I already here generated a report for the last week uh, of data collected by agents and targets. You can see that uh, for agents, we have different uh, values like the availability of the agent, which can also correspond to the availability of the location where the agent is located. We have the download and upload speed if that agent was included in a network speed test. And we have the number of critical alerts and performance alerts logged by that agent. So each value of this, uh, of this report gives you different information about a specific location. Performance alerts, you understand how good or bad is the performance of the location. The critical alerts mostly are uh, associated with the uh, downtime of uh, the uh, remote location. Download and upload speed, I think is pretty self-explanatory and so availability. In the second section uh, of the network summary report, you can see targets, you can see what application you're monitoring, the page load time, uh, the number of alerts and performance alerts. So very similar to the above table with the difference that this is about in a, a particular application. <clears throat> um, if we skip, uh, jump on the second tab, you can see a typical agent report. Uh, for example, I want to understand the performance uh, of the network at a specific site where I install uh, my agents. So I'm selecting the agent as you can see here and then I select the time period and now the dashboard is uh, giving me the information about that specific location and here you can see the swim lane representation of the performance of the monitor application by that agent. Here you can see the timeline of performance throughout the time period selected and in the bottom uh, the overall summaries or average performance for the time period. Uh, here also we give you a way to interact with the data, apply filters to your report. The target is a very similar uh, with the difference that uh, you are uh, seeing uh, from all the agents perspective, the performance of an application. Uh, so now I selected, for example, Salesforce, which is an application that we have included in our list of monitor apps. And you can see that now I'll see the overall performance to Salesforce from all the agents included in that um, target, the overall timeline and the averages. Very similar to the agent report with the difference that here we're reviewing performance to an app. And in the case of Salesforce, it looks like pretty good user experience as everything is green, no downtime, no performance issues, DNS time is pretty good, and so HTTP is below half second. I remind you that this only includes HTTP get time at the moment. The last one is the uh, most interesting one, I believe, because here you can see all the data for the scheduled test from all your agents. Now, I selected a lot of data here, so bear with me, but as you can see, um, I'm uh, 
uh, plotting the data from Hyper, Speedtest, and VoIP run by all my agents. You can see here is the Hyper that reports bandwidth jitter and packet loss. You can see the VoIP with the jitter latency and MOS, no packet loss, and then the throughput or download. Something uh, good to know about reports, you can also zoom in, zoom out in specific time period if you want to drill down uh, the data that you uh, display. And now all these reports can be downloaded as PDF files uh, and save it and then maybe send to your team. Um, you can also schedule uh, email reports to be sent to your inbox. To do that, you'll have to create a preset that uh, determines what type of report you want to display and the settings. So for instance, if I want to receive a network status summary every week on Monday at 8 a.m., I select the time period, I can include or not the alert history, and then I save it as preset with a specific name. Right, now that I have the preset saved, I go into manage email reports, I create a new email report, I name the email report that I want to receive, like demo for example, I select the report that I, the, the preset that I just created before, pick the schedule, let's say um, on a day, uh, no, I'm sorry, every week on Monday at 8 a.m. There you go, what is it? And then I choose the destination, which can be network ops, for example, and netbiz.net. There you go, and then I save my preset. As you can see, now I will receive every week at, on Monday at 8 a.m. that uh, report that I uh, saved. With that, this concludes uh, today's live demo. I hope this uh, uh, short video was beneficial to understand how to run uh, network reports and receive it in your inbox. If there is anything more you'd like to know about, please uh, comment uh, in the video or uh, send us uh, an email or uh, demo request at uh, uh, info at netbiz.net or go to netbiz.net. Uh, Have a great day.